Uh, on its way in is Federal Cachero. Uh, it's on its way down from Sault Ste. Marie. Uh, should be here in about 15, 20 minutes. It's, uh, it's probably about 10 kilometers out at the moment. So it shouldn't be too long before it starts slowing down and making its way in. Uh, so we're gonna wait for it here, then we're gonna follow it into Port Coburn and down to the lift bridge and off it goes. Uh, from what I know of, this particular vessel is coming in from Sault Ste. Marie, making its way to Montreal. And uh, for what I've read on its schedule, it's then heading out to Antwerp. Uh, where it'll be there for a couple of weeks before sailing back to the Great Lakes and then we'll return here sometime in November. So uh, it's got a long journey ahead of it. So we're gonna make sure we get a good view of it as it comes through here in Port Coburn. Right, we've got Federal Kashiro just off in the distance, a few kilometers out there. And just making its way out to greet it is the pilot boat. Nice rough ride for them all. Little sailing boats went out as well. Really choppy out there. Federal Kashiro is just out there right now. Uh, it's still moving, it's just very slowly. It looks like it's moving itself to line up to the channel. Like I said, we've got very uh, gusty uh, easterly winds right now. Uh, the pilot boat's making its way back. Uh, first of all, I thought it had stopped, but it hadn't. I just checked on the uh, marine traffic and it is still moving seven kilometers an hour. I just had another look at marine traffic. It looks like I'm gonna be here for a little while. Uh, Sunovic is just approaching lock eight. And that's probably why it's positioned that way now. Um, the federal one, just waiting for Sunovic to clear the last lock before it enters in here, or it might be waiting for it to actually exit uh, the Welland Canal and out onto the Lee Gary before this one comes in. So a bit of a waiting game anyway. As we await Kashiro to come in, we get to see Sonovic go out. We'll just race ahead and I'll pull over, then we can uh, have a good listen till we go by.
you have it. Sonovic on her way out. And Koshiro, uh, Koshiro on her way in very, very shortly. After quite a bit of waiting around, <laughs> we're finally making our way in. Federal Kashiro making our way into the Welland Canal off Lake Erie. I've been waiting for this for a couple of hours. It's a shame I can't get out there to get a closer look because it is a little choppy just where she is. It starts to break up once you get to this point here. So anyway, we'll enjoy it as she comes by. Federal Kashiro is a bulk carrier vessel built in 2004 by Shin Karushima in Tokyo, Japan. She sails under the flag of the Marshall Islands and she has an overall length of 225 meters along with a beam of 32.26 meters and her gross tonnage is 40,000 tons. The Federal Kashiro is operated by FedNav Limited which is a Canadian shipping company based in Montreal. FedNav is known for its fleet of bulk carriers and operates in various regions around the world. Couple of crew members giving us a wave. Bridge is going up and the vessel is quickly approaching.
No messing around. First attempt, no push, no nothing. Straight in, right against the pier there. That's a really good maneuver, that. Someone's done that a few times. So there you have it, folks. Federal Kashiro. Uh, just making a quick stop here in Port Cobe before she heads on up to Montreal and then over to Antwerp in Belgium before coming back to the Great Lakes in a couple of months' time. Anyway, that is it for this particular video. Hope you enjoyed it. Until the next time, see you all very soon. Stay safe.